spontaneous. You know, we all have this, we all have this urge sometimes to just be spontaneous. It doesn't matter where you're going, you have no plan, you just, you just have this urge to go. So this morning I, I woke up with this just desire to be spontaneous. I just wanted to, to go somewhere. And on top of that, I was also really, really craving Waffle House. So let's go. I just need someone in my life to give it structure To handle all the selfish ways I'd spend my time without So the other problem here is um, Waffle House is 120 miles away. I have no car and um, don't really know where to go. It's kind of what this whole thing's about. So uh, I've been looking at my phone here at Penn Station. I think I gotta take a train all the way to Pennsylvania and then maybe a, a, a bus or something. I Honestly, I have no clue. So I, I think I got step one down. I gotta go to Pennsylvania. And Waffle House is literally all the way in Delaware. So I'm going to be in three states today. Yeah. But I just passed through Philadelphia and now have arrived in Wilmington, Delaware. So, two states. We have officially been in three states today. I believe now I have to get on some sort of bus and it'll take me somewhere in Delaware to the Waffle House. How many special people change? How many lives are living strange? Where were you while we were getting high? Slowly walking down the hall Faster than a cannonball Where were you while we were getting high? I've been here all day, I've been waiting for this moment, and it finally came. We've officially made it to Waffle House. Put them all on one plate. That's all right, I'm gonna down these waffles. I didn't come here for nothing. I just want to say thank you. Adios. Adios. You guys did great, great service. Great thank service. Bye-bye. Man, you guys are probably thinking I'm, they're probably thinking I'm crazy. I told them the story. Came all the way from New York today to get some Waffle House. And they were like, oh my God. Oh my God, he's a famous YouTuber. Oh my God, make him the best waffles. We're catching the bus back to, um, back to Wilmington, back on the train then. To, uh, probably home. So, uh, chains of plans. So this whole thing was to be spontaneous, right? To, to not plan ahead, not make sure everything's in place, just to go. It's the whole, it's what being spontaneous is about. And, um, well, yeah, I didn't plan, and I'm gonna have to wait an hour for this bus, which is gonna go back to Wilmington, and from there, get an Amtrak to Philadelphia, and then not be able to get on another Amtrak to New York until about 12 tomorrow. Meaning, I'm gonna be stuck in Philadelphia, homeless, for the whole night. Now, I could obviously probably get like a hotel room or something, but I don't have an ID kind of stuck but honestly I've never been to Philly and it's gonna be a, a cold homeless lonely tired night 
we're gonna make the best of it. So I've just been sitting here waiting for the bus and looking at the orange sun over there. And I feel like a lot of people now in times like this might be like upset, thinking about, oh, I gotta be on the cold, oh, I gotta be in Philly all night, blah, 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 blah. But like, to me, this is like when I'm the most happy. There's just like a sense of being free, not really knowing what's to come, just living in the moment. Uh, it's definitely a blessing. I'm very, very happy that I came out here. Definitely enjoyed some Waffle House. Speaking of that, I left my... Uh, I had extra Waffle House. I forgot it, but it's alright. I'm going to be hungry tonight. <laughs> but yeah, it's, uh, it's going to be an exciting night. And I uh, just want to let you know I'm pretty happy right now. Again. Oh, please never fall in love again. And if some other guy catches your eye. Please just text me goodbye. You know I don't look pretty when I cry, and I don't want that to be a final glimpse of me, babe. But if you could please return my track. So I'm here in Philadelphia, found a 7-Eleven, got some horrible tasting coffee, iced coffee, tastes like fake, tastes like they didn't need not even coffee in it, it just tastes like they like modifiedly made it through, I don't know. Then we also got some, probably going to be horrible taquitos, and um, I guess those are pretty bomb, I ain't gonna lie. So far we've been walking around Philly for maybe an hour, hour and a half, and it's got its pros and cons, most of the cons. It's very clean, I like the architecture, it's nice, everything's very, it seems nice and well taken care of, but it's boring. There's like nothing to do here, like I feel like I could walk around and just see nothing interesting. There's like no restaurants or bars or like delis, there's no delis. There's like barely any people. There's like no, no energy here. Boring, I'm bored. We're gonna continue to push through it and maybe, or maybe take a little rest somewhere. Try to sleep. But these are really good, I might go back and get more. These are really good. Actually did the one thing that I wanted to do here in Philly but um yeah that's about the only thing thing I wanted to do Four 
4 a.m. I fell asleep for maybe like 30 minutes. And uh, I'm actually pretty comfortable on that bench. Until I woke up freezing. It's so cold. So I'm gonna try to look for somewhere indoors to sleep. I'm gonna be heading back to Nueve Short. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was definitely a fun time, being spontaneous and just coming out and doing it. You might think it seemed very unenjoyable traveling all the way out here just to like sleep on a bench. But it's just like good to get out every once in a while and suffer a little bit, be free. It's necessary sometimes, so yeah. Hope you guys enjoy this video and uh, stay spontaneous.